welcome back to the channel. So I know I look rough, first of all. Let's address that. And it's because I didn't do my foam roller foam rollers last night and I had class today and it was rainy so I really didn't care what I looked like. My hair was literally up into a claw clip until I started recording. But tomorrow is game day. Officially college game day is gonna be here in Tuscaloosa and literally everybody and their mother is gonna try and go and be there and I have to be up at no joke probably five o'clock maybe six at the latest so that I can get there early enough. The line opens for Crimson Chaos members at 9.30, but that's when it opens. That's not when the line starts. So I have to get there even earlier than that just to stand in line. And I'm thinking 7 is a good time, but the more that I think about it, I'm like, I think I have to get there even earlier than that. But it's a white out, so I'm going to make an outfit. I went to Hobby Lobby and bought a white sweatshirt, and then I got some puffy HTV vinyl. I don't really know how I feel about this. She gave me the instructions because my mom nor I have ever used puffy vinyl. So if I do it, it's just going to be on the sleeves. And then for the actual sweatshirt itself, I'm going to do white glitter. I just hope that it looks good because like it's going to be white on white and you'll only be able to see it from a certain angle. But I think I can make it work. I a tornado flew around my room before you came. Excuse the mess it made. Usually it doesn't rain in Southern California. We are at Coleman Coliseum at a bright 7 a.m. this morning. It's college game day is here. I can see their bus and see everything and I am already tired. I just hope that when I get across the back, it's not completely gone and that there's still like not that many people. Who knows? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Mark's here. He said it's time to go to war. Go to gonna start or how it started because I was recording yesterday when I went to college game day and then like the actual game itself but I don't know if that's gonna be a whole separate video if that's even gonna be included in this video 
to be honest i really don't know but let me tell y'all about the day i had yesterday so i went to college game day right cool 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 vibes yada 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 and afterwards i go to the mall here in tuscaloosa keep in mind if you're from huntsville if y'all remember what madison square mall was like before it's closed that's basically how this mall is but they have like a few restaurants in there and so i wanted american deli and i was like okay cool so i go and i'm heading to american deli i'm literally about to park and i am in the lane to turn left i have my blinker on but i can't immediately turn left because there's pedestrians in the crosswalk so i'm like okay cool i'm waiting i'm taking my time and then there's no more pedestrians and there's no cars coming towards me and i'm like all right cool like i can go ahead and turn and then i look over my shoulder and there's somebody on the left side of me keep in mind cars are only supposed to be coming from in front of me not from behind me and so i was like what are you doing i literally said that in my car i was like what are you doing and so i like turned i didn't like he didn't hit my car i didn't hit his car whatever whatever and i park and he like whenever i turn left he turns behind me because that was his initial plan anyway i'm assuming so i'm like okay like that's weird and he turns behind me and I'm like, oh, okay, like he's just gonna park. And I didn't see his car. So I thought, like whenever I parked, I didn't see his car behind me and I didn't see it go past me. So I was like, oh, he parked closer up. Maybe he's like picking up an order from Applebee's or something. Cause there was like parking spots up there or yada, or maybe he was like parking a handicap spot. I really don't know. But I go to get out of my car. I'm out of my car at this point. My door is open. Like I'm out of the car and my door is open, but I haven't closed my door yet. You know what I mean? And then he's like, I, did you just bucket me? It caught me off surprise. I was like, huh? He was like, did you just bucket me? I saw you in your car. You just bucked at me. I saw you were da 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 And I'm like, I was like, no, I didn't bucket you. And I just like made up a lie. I was like, I was on the phone. He's like, oh, okay. You were in the wrong. And then you just came at me when I was getting out of my car when you were in the wrong. And it's also like, I didn't buck at you. I definitely said something about you in my car, but bucking at you, I didn't do that. I'm in my car, I'm driving. Like, I don't, yeah, I was doing this. Like, no, I wasn't doing that. I literally was like, what are you doing? Like, that makes no sense. And so when he said that to me, approached me at my car instead of just going on about his business when he was in the wrong, it caught me so off guard. And then I was like, you've got to be kidding me. Like, I was so mad because I was like, first of all, you were in the wrong okay you were in the wrong second of all you approached me at my car when you were in the wrong and then to top it all off he's driving and there's someone in the passenger seat and someone in the back seat right neither one of them say hey like that's not cool like it's really not that deep like calm down like they're just sitting there and i'm like oh okay it is 10 52 i am just now getting ready for the day because after i went to the game yesterday and like standing in line everything like that i I didn't sleep in, but I stayed in my bed longer than I normally would. But I do need to run a couple of errands. I'm going to get a coffee from Dunkin' because I have a bunch of points to get free coffees for a minute. So I've just been using those really only on Sundays because that's the only time I can go out of my way to get something. I'm going to Dunkin' Jersey Mike's because again, I only crave Jersey Mike's on Sundays. Do not ask me why. I literally do not eat Jersey Mike's throughout the week, but on Sundays, I'm like, I'm craving it. I'm also gonna go to Target to get some Hawaiian rolls and cheese, cause for some odd reason, the only thing I want for dinner is cheesy bread. I, I don't want any entree, I just want bread. Just left Dunkin'. I was just gonna go through the drive-thru cause I really don't look my best today, but the line was extremely long and I was like, mm, you know what, I'm just gonna go in and it'll be quicker. So, I got, hold on, I have the receipt. A, Hold on, I'm also trying to focus on driving. Uh, a medium iced cappuccino with three butter pecan, three vanilla, and then also liquid cane sugar. So let's give it a try. It's very frothy, because I saw a TikTok, which is why I decided to get this, because I've never had an iced cappuccino before, and it's like frothy at the top, if you can see. Let's give it a taste. Oh, I like that. That's good. It's not sweet, but I don't mind that at all. Wow, this might be my new Dunkin' order. I'm getting Jersey Mike's for lunch, and I was debating if I wanted to go in the TJ Maxx, because it's literally right here, but 
I'm like, you know what? Let's not spend more money today than necessary because literally when I go home on Friday, I'm going to be spending like 200 and some dollars, one on my nails and then some of my hair so humid outside i didn't realize it till i walked out and i was like oh my gosh like it is smoldering it's not even hot it's just humid anywho also um i got off the phone with my mom and she's placing an order for me to get a pepper spray even though in the situation that occurred the other day pepper spray really wouldn't have been like beneficial because it's they have to be closer in range for me to spray them but still just as a safety precaution and whenever like basketball and football season starts i'll have to take it off but that hasn't happened yet and it'll be a while before that happens because there's one more game and i think it's next saturday but i'm not going because i'll be in huntsville actually that particular day i'll be in birmingham but i'm not going so basically yesterday when i went to the tennessee game that was the last game that i was ever going to go to for the season which it's kind of crazy to me. I didn't really think about it that way until I got home and I was like, wait a minute. I'm not going to the next game. Like, that was it. That was it. Literally, football and basketball season are over for my first year here. I went, I already got my sandwich or whatever, and then I just left Target. All I got was this thing to make my bread because what I've been doing is just taking like a bowl heating it up and then just spreading it over there and rubbing it in with a spoon there's actually a tool for that and it's a baster so i got that i also got some slices of mozzarella cheese because before i was using the sprinkles but i'm like you know what it actually makes more sense to put slices in there so then like it's really you know coated Ooh, this base is bumping and then i got hawaiian rolls and then also a two pack of AAA batteries because my amazon no 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 my prime no my fire stick isn't working properly and i think because the battery is partially going out so i just need to replace the batteries and hopefully that'll solve the issue because it only works if i have it turned at a certain angle and only certain buttons work and i'm like yeah that's not good i hope it's just a battery issue and not like something's actually wrong with the buttons because that means i'd have to order a whole another fire stick probably and then I have to figure out how to program that because when I moved I didn't program it myself my dad did my dad did all things on my TV and like you have to connect it to the Wi-Fi and da -da -da -da. it's just it's a lot but we're headed back home I'm literally no more than five minutes away so when I get back I'll start doing all of the Sunday reset things that I'm gonna go ahead and close out this video because I'm literally about to get in the shower once I get out do my hair and then get in the bed I did a lot of homework like very very early even though I literally have stuff to do this week I was like might as well go ahead and knock out the easy stuff long term so long story short this is where we're gonna end the video I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll catch you guys in my next one bye